friends, Miss Janet here from the Stovall Library, and I have a craft idea for you today. I thought we could make some paper roll monsters. So all you need to do is get some construction paper, any color that you choose, and um, a toilet paper roll, as many as you would like, because you can easily make lots of monsters depending on your ideas that you have in your head. So you're just gonna get your colored paper, your construction paper, and cut a strip of paper that's gonna just fit right around your roll. So you'll wanna cut it, and then you're going to be gluing it onto your roll, and then you're gonna make him into a monster, however you um, think it would look whether he's going to have googly eyes or a scary mouth or a s silly nose, whatever you think. I've made a couple of different ones. So one, I have made him red and I've given him lots of eyes with a silly mouth. So he's called my five-eyed monster. And then I made one other one today and he's got his arms and he's, if you can see him very well, he's got kind of a scary mouth. He's also got googly eyes. So if you have googly eyes, those are great to use. I have a little bag of googly eyes, but you can make your own eyes. You can just cut out a white circle with a black dot, and then you can give him any kind of eyes you want. They can be cross-eyed eyes or just regular eyes. So that's what you can do today. So you just need your rolls, empty rolls, some construction paper, any color that you have, some scissors and some glue and some googly eyes if you have them or you can easily make your own. Oh, and I also use marker for this guy's mouth and nose. So you can cut out like I did here. You can cut out a black construction paper and give him a black construction paper mouth or you can draw his mouth on and you could even do that with a crayon or a marker of any sort that you have around. So I hope you make some monsters and then perhaps you will even decide to put on a little puppet show and you can have your monsters out and about. Maybe they're scaring people or maybe they're out grocery shopping or maybe they're out at the playground. Whatever, you come up with a little play and you incorporate your little puppets. They can become puppets. They're not only um, paper roll monsters, but they could be puppets for a puppet show. So have fun. I hope you make some awesome puppets, monsters, and have fun with them. And I will see you soon. Bye for now.